Hi, um, today I'm doing the review on this um, Geek Vape Aegis Mini. Um, I brought this yesterday. I have to admit, I love it. It's really nice design. I love this camo here. It's like I don't know if that's real leather or fake leather, but it feels really nice in your hand. It's a tiny little mod. As you can see, my hand it covers it. Um, I ordered this uh, bubble glass yesterday off eBay, and that come today, which is much better for it. holds holds a lot more liquid. Um, this has the um, Cerberus tank on. This I'm um, I'm really new to vaping. Um, I say just bear with me. Um, what can I say? Uh, this has got a mesh coil in. It, it's a low wattage device. I love the clickiness of the buttons, as you can hear. As you can see with that, I've I've got the wattage on 32, and if you hold down both these buttons together, that will lock the wattage in, so you can't actually change it unless you unlock it. Um, I believe this goes up to 80 watts, but um. Yeah, it's got the, like I said, Cerberus tank on, put the bubble glass on, you've got airflow down here, which you can adjust just by twisting it. So it's closed, open. I always keep it open. Um, I really like this tank. Um, nice and easy to fill, just like about 180 degree turn, and the top comes off. And then you've got the two slots up there. So that's really nice and easy just put it back on twist it that's done um, I've been looking at the reviews for these they're supposedly water resistant which I actually quite believe and watched a video of someone putting it in a bowl of water and it still worked fine they're shock proof dust proof you can um, you can adjust the brightness of the screen. You, you can do quite a lot on this, but because I'm I'm really new to this, I only brought this yesterday. I'm still still getting to grips with it. Um, you got a charging port. So I just pull it out down the bottom here. I don't know if you can see that very well. I'm only filming off my phone camera. And this little flat thing. That that keeps it all waterproof. In the box, I got um spare glass, spare coil, spare o-rings, charger and so all the little information booklet and everything. Um, this has the mesh coil in, like I said it gives really good flavour. For a low wattage device I'm, I'm so pleased of it, it gives out so much vapour. Um, internal battery so you just Plug it in, charge it and play. Nice and easy for beginner vapors like myself. Um, it tells, I don't really know all the wattage, well, amps and volts and everything, but it's saying coil 0 0.34, amp is 0, 0.00, but when you press the button it's 10.3. Um, volts is 3.30 and it counts how many puffs you do. You can go into the settings and reset it all um, yeah like I said for a low wattage device it gives out so much cloud look I'll show you I'm um, currently using the liquid I have in here is um, Mr Wicks orange and lime fizz it's got a hint of like menthol to it but it's really nice really refreshing I've, I've tried quite a few liquids I have to admit Mr Wix is one of my favorites I also like the UFO and um, sorry the rewind UFO one that's nice um, I've also got this Mr Wix jam scone that's a um, when you smell it out the bottle it smells like the jam uh, when you 
take a drag of it, it um, you get a real nice rich like buttery taste so that's really nice but um, yeah back to this really nice nice mod really comfortable in your hand I'm just I'm really pleased with it so I, I'm a new vapor so I haven't I haven't even thought about the mods where you build yourself or do the batteries I'd rather do loads of homework first before attempting anything like that but yeah I, I can't even I'm so new to it I can't even tell you what sort of, sort of amp hour battery or whatever it's got in it but I'm just completely completely new to this thought I'd show you just because I like it um, I do love how clicky the buttons are nice clicks some people won't like that but I personally I, I do like it um, it's just I'm just really pleased with it I'm, honestly I can't say more any more good things about it really it's, yeah so I'll just do another drag so you can show so I can show you like, like I said I'm new to this I suck at it bear with me they'll get better the more videos I do but Yeah, the um, the amount of cloud this gives out is absolutely amazing. It's um, a really nice, smooth, light hit, if that makes any sense. It's so much flavour. It's just brilliant. I really do like it. Really pleased with it. This is my first Geek Vape I've had. Other than that, I've used um, a, I've had a smock. 22 pen which I, I did like that as nice and easy to use um, I've got a Vupu Drag 2 Mini which I'll do a review on but um, yeah I love this I'm so pleased with it it's a nice compact design well built feels feels really well built solid it really is I'm really pleased with it The um, I'd say the one complaint I have about it is when you're taking a drag, there's like a whistle that doesn't re that doesn't bother me, but it might bother some people. But yeah, it doesn't really bother me. But you can probably hear it when I take a drag, really. I just can't get over that cloud production. It's that's brilliant really good really pleased with it like I said I'll, I'll do a video of my Vupu Drag 2 and um, yeah if you give me a like and subscribe that would be brilliant cheers